All right, hello everybody. We are back to Mincecraft again, and we are continuing from where we left off. Um, if you're watching my version of it, all this is totally new. Uh, it's because Digitized here did some renovations on his own while I was gone. And you're gonna have that on your channel, right? Just all the all the renovations you did. Yeah, I'm. Mean, you keep in mind I, I skip around, but yeah. Yeah, that's 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 fine. And from where I left off, I showed you how to build the basic orp reproduction over here. Oh, looks like it's done. We're going to keep processing ore. See, all this stuff we saved, you just keep sending it through. Don't need this clogging up my inventory. And for this episode, I'm going to try and work on a nuclear reactor next. Now I think the only reactor mod in this mod and the in the Infinity mod pack is the big reactors mod, which is great because it's the easiest and most user friendly to use. Plus, you don't get any uh, side things like blowing up your house and leaking radiation everywhere because that that's just always a blast. No, <laughs> pu no pun intended. <laughs> Uh, that was so just like oh some a quick note oh yes we have two more people pointless cacti and i spunky mc so what we have planned is digitized and i are forming our own team and we those are those other two guys are on their own team i don't know where they are they're somewhere off that way uh, they're forming their own base, and the goal is to get enough people that we can actually like start like a factions thing. So it'll be all of us, like teams of two versus each other, like a Game of Thrones kind of style. You know. Okay. Okay, so for starting out for big reactors, you're going to need pretty much all the pieces evolve around the casing. So you're going to need a bunch of graphite, which is coal or gra or charcoal which is just a, a smelted log but you can't turn it into plank so pretty easy to get if you want to save your coal uh, smelt those into graphite bars uh, you're gonna need a ton of these I don't know exactly how much and then a ton of iron as well so that's the good that's why I like starting out with the the pulverizer because you can double all the uranium you find because it's a really rare ore and you're gonna need as much as you can get your hands on so I'm probably going to make a cut here unless something interesting happens Why I'm just processing these ores and so we can get right back to building all the pieces for our reactor. It's like all of it, so... Goodbye! We need to go deeper. That's what she said. Oh my god, it teleported me onto a dungeon, dude. Oh, uh, I can't... Oh, hold on, I'm join you in just a second I'm gonna finish this round of uranium if I could stop freezing that would be great where'd you yeah, put the oh hey the, you mean the giant purple portal right here yeah where did I put the giant purple portal I don't know yeah that one yeah no joke though dude it um it, it spawned oh my god there's a ghast Quickly get when once you load in, move. Oh shit! I fell down. Like you fell? Yeah, I'm inside. Shit, I don't have a pick either. Where are you? I'm. In, look, look down. To to your left, behind you. See me? Oh. Can oh, you okay. give me some sticks or like blocks or something? Uh, I'm just gonna mine through the wall right here. Okay, I don't, yeah, I don't have a pick. Just follow me. Stick with oh, me. Nether wart. All that that gives us an advantage. Hey, wait, where's where's luggage? It's it didn't go through the portal. Luggage didn't go through. No, I don't think it can. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. I get saw him, it okay? sitting outside the portal. I'm gonna go get him. Okay. All right. Him. Him. His name is Box. Box, of course. I named Shaco the Shaco clone Box. <laughs> yeah, what'd you call Box? Because it, it, it is a box. 
I don't know yeah, what Yeah, everything want. in computers is boxes. Digital box. Digital. Okay, I brought box back. Can I go through the portal? Yeah, look, he's right here. Okay. Well, he can't walk through on his own, but I brought him. But when you go through it, I'm surprised it didn't just automate him. He'll just go eat everything, by the way, so you don't have to worry about picking stuff up. Well, I mean, it's just, I'm just naturally picking it up trying to mine it, but... Yeah, I know, but like, if you mine a resource and you walk away from it... Ooh, dude, two diamonds and gold Ouch. armor. Where are you? Uh, further down the... Here, go up. We need glowstone as well, so I can make some better... No, other way, other way. Well, hold on, there's a chest here. Oh, okay. Uh, by the way... Gold armor and two saddles. Let me take all the gold. Button. Yeah, I'll give you all the... Because I'm smelting gold down into other blocks. Alright, let's go this way. Oh, there's a ton of glowstone over there. Yeah, I see it. There was another chest down here I wanted to go see. Is it a tarp? I guess. Oh, there's nothing in there. Just cut down these chests, by the way, if you um, mine them. Thorn vines? Yeah, I've noticed those spawn. I don't know what they are. Saddle. What are you guys doing? Are you, are you decent? I'm wondering if this sock means something. Oh, God. No, it doesn't mean shit. It just means there's a sock. <laughs> what mean is wrong shit? with you guys? It means there's a sock. It, no. I'm playing Minecraft. Yeah, I'm jerking off in here. Place a block. Place a block. Dude, dude, those... Get me, Creeper, get me. Block, block porn? Yeah. Are you hungry? No, no, no I'm not hungry. Some, I've seen some shit. No, the sock doesn't mean anything. If you... God. Sometimes I love my roommates and sometimes I hate my roommates. I'd recommend going back to the portal, to be honest. Why? If you don't have a pick, you might die. As well as you get us some more advanced stuff while I mine, okay? Okay. I just wanted to look. I didn't think this is like the first time it spawned us in a castle. Yeah, that's, that's why. Awesome. Like, out. Right. Well, that puts us phenomenally ahead. I'm gonna plant this. Uh, well, I had to wait for stuff to grind anyway, so. Uh, so you want to quest with me then? Oh no, it's probably done now. I just wanted to. Uh, we're, I'm gonna put the soul sand down somewhere. Okay. I'll, I'll just put it over by the. Uh, the factory stuff so if you want to move it later you can but just to get this uh another wart to start growing okay you know gravestone i am a little worried though because there are quite a few pigmen around me just yeah i guess try not to aggro them well you remember how this works right uh i don't think I so eye bulb no okay so anyway um <laughs> my my roommates, like, I guess one of the socks fell out of my uh, laundry basket and it was in front of the door and they thought it meant, like, you know, don't come in my room. Like, I'm, I'm busy, if you know what I mean. Oh, yeah. So they're like, I hear them like, okay, I'll open the door and you look inside, blah, blah, and they, like, swing the door open and they're looking in, like, are you decent? Like, what the fuck are you talking about? Of course I am. Like, we didn't know if the sock in front of the door meant. I'm like, no, it's just a fucking sock. It's just a fucking sock. It fell sock. out of my goddamn laundry basket because, you know, the dorm rooms are tiny, so. Yeah. <sighs> Do you know if pigmen still get aggroed when you mine stuff? Uh, I really have no idea. Because the pigmen have a huge probability to fuck me over. Go to bed. Someone. I can't. There we go. Uh, another pig iron ore? Uh, pig oh my god. I think it oh. turns into steel. I'm not exactly sure what it does. What about cobalt? Uh, I don't think you can mine that with a diamond pick. You have to, That's one of the... You have to make um, it's like armite or something out of... Uh, your, the, you, remember the, you know that furnace you built on top of the roof? Yeah, you have to. It's one of the um, compounds you can make in that. It's like it's obsidian and aluminum. I think it makes like this pink ore, uh, yeah. but that's the only thing strong enough to mine cobalt. Unless you had a bedrock pick, but that's not in this mod pack. So yeah, no. I wish we did. Don't worry, I'm fucking them up. I will see you. This in the diamond sword is destroying them. Remember the last time I had like an iron sword? 
<laughs> yeah. Oh no. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, that was weird. That was yeah. Really... God damn. Wrecked. Okay. Oh, I was gonna try not to do that. <sighs> I need one diamond. Did you have them anywhere? Uh, I have them. Okay. Well, when you get back, I need one. Okay, I've got eleven. Okay, I just. <laughs> oh. Are you finding so many? Oh, is that from the? Yeah. All the stuff in there. Okay. I don't chance. need it just yet. I'm gonna go get. S I need. Um. I'm so happy. I have not yet been like hit by a pick. Well, I, okay, of course, the second I say that, I get hit. <laughs> Stop. Jeez. Stop. Oh, no. Uh. no, no, no. Get back the hell away from me right now, you goddamn whore. Die, die, die. Oh, Jesus Christ. We need to make some instant health potions for the nether. Uh, well, now that we have nether wart. We can start making some podens. Podens? Podens. I'm, I'm saying it with a different uh, pronunciation. Okay, so, uh, back to discovering the reactor. Uh, I did some pillaging with my friend through the nether, which was really just him doing most of the work. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just a shooter who takes credit for it. So, yeah, yeah, we've got the some nether wart going. So to start off, uh, <laughs> no, no, <laughs> that's called, dude. And that's how it works in real life. If I hit you, you take damage. I want not to hit you. Okay. Anyway, back to the tutorial. Um, so I have a bag, big bag of Butterfingers bites right here, and every time I eat one, I want to throw up, but I keep eating them. Uh, that's, I really don't have a response for that. Anyway, <laughs> so the basic block what you need for all the reactor stuff is this one, and I actually already made a bunch. I didn't show you how to make them. It's pretty simple. That oh no, I did show you guys. It's, it's been a while, so but you didn't actually get to see me make him. And then all that gives you four casings, so uh, it's pretty easy to get a whole stack of them. Uh, I'm gonna dump everything into this chest real quick, so I'm probably gonna need the inventory space. I need lava. Do you have any lava buckets? Um, no, but uh, can you see me? Yeah, there, there's a pool somewhere over there. Oh really? Oh, it's oh, uh, it's on the mini map. Can you see it? Yeah. Like, Do you have a crafting table? Cool. I'm gonna use it. Yeah, first. it's literally just that way. Like it's it's over by the desert. Okay. I'm gonna make some buckets real quick. Okay. A bucket. A bucket. A bucket. Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna start off with the casing, and then you're gonna need at least one power tap, which is four casing and four redstone. Pretty easy to do. Do that. Ah, you're right. It's right here. Yeah. See, I know what I'm talking about. Oh, no. Don't oh. die. Uh, you're going to need one controller. This is the most expensive part because you need the diamond for it. Which, I don't know how in real life a diamond would actually make like a computer screen, but hey. But hey. This is a video game. And then we're going to need at least one of these. A control rod. Which you need those those graphites, which actually I'm gonna have to. Oh no, never mind. I got a bunch. I got enough. Which is these? If I did that right, I don't think so. There we go. And we're gonna need at least two fuel rods, because I do two high, which is which eventually will expand to three. But for the basic one, we're gonna start off with now is this the, the six iron ingots, two graphite, and the lorium. Or any any form of uranium, it really doesn't matter. Oops. Oh, I for, forgot. I'm making two. Then have a bunch of the casing. So I don't. You're gonna need a bunch of glass. Uh, hold on, I'm gonna switch it to daytime before we start building this. <clears throat> 
Usually what I do is I build the casing first, and then I start going on with the glass. So, because you need to turn the glass into, or you, you turn from the casing, you can convert it into glass. I don't know how that would work in real life, but hey. But hey. But hey. Oh, did you figure out where you wanted to build this yet, Adam? Build what? The reactor. Uh, yeah, I just have to do some stuff first. Uh, so through the power of editing, we will magically create a spot where we want to build this. <laughs> so through the power of editing, we created nothing. Uh, <laughs> do you so keep doing that, just toggling it on and off? No, I'm just going to make a video. Oh, your chest likes flowers. Okay, anyway, so I guess we're just going to build it here for now. We'll probably build a better room for it later. So this is just doing a one core reactor. So you can do... Come on, there you go. So that's going to be the very center of the reactor. We're going to do one layer around it for space in between. And then the outer layer. Oops. God damn it. Then I'll put the control panel there. Where? Oh, we have to make one more thing, which is the the way you actually get your fuel in and out of it with the access port, which is a piston, a chest, and four of your casings. I made those like prior, and I couldn't remember why I had those. <laughs> I'll just put that over here. It doesn't have to be this way. You can do it any way you want, uh, as long as it's all connected. It's it's cool cool that way because it's um it's really like the I I like this one like the it's not the most it's not the best reactor mod I've seen, but it's cool in the sense that like it's kind of does it based on how you design it. Okay, so it looks like we're short some casing. And basically what we're going to do is we're going to fill up this, oh, that's interesting, fill up this last area, and then we're going to circle around the top here, and then we'll fill up the rest of this area with just straight glass. So I will be right back. We're going to make more of those uh, casings. And I think, actually, actually, I'm just going to do it right here real quick. You might have enough. Do you have any cobblestone? I do not. Yeah, that's probably more than enough. Uh, I know I made a, probably a lot extra for those of you thinking, why does he need that much? But I will expand upon this. So, Okay, and then to fill up the rest of the area with glass, you have to use reactor glass, which is just this, that. Fill it up. Now, I don't know why, but try not to mess this up, because this, for some reason, the glass takes forever to mine. Uh, it worked really easily in... I see, there we go. Uh, it's a little faster, but it used to take, like, a really long time just to mine the glass. And, like, the old Feed the Beast. Oh, and you'll know you've done it correct when that makes the shape, and your controller turns red. Uh, now, I can't turn it on because there's, I mean, it's on, but nothing's happening because there's nothing in there. So we go to our fuel port, put in the fuel, it will automatically fill it up. We have a lot of reserve for now. Uh, I'm going to make a, some ladders real quick. And you can put ladders on here without interrupting the multi-block structure. But you will throw it off, though. Like, say, if you any any big reactor's mind, you place it next to it, it's going to think it's part of it, and it'll throw off the multi-block structure. But if I get rid of it, it immediately goes back. Uh, I'm not going to turn it on just yet, since it's only a, a single-core reactor. <coughs> what are you... Wait, what are they talking about? Don't worry about it. Are they trying to trade with us? No. <laughs> uh, anyway, 
uh, and if you come to the top here, you can adjust, you can rod insertion. Uh, this slows down, so basically, like, you don't burn up your fuel as fast. Since it's only a dual core, I'm going to leave it at 0%. Uh, and it's actually like an inverse. So there's like no interference. Excuse me, sorry. So basically it's giving its max power output. Since it's only a single core, we kind of need that. Uh, you'll see all these stats go up. And it has an internal buffer of a million redstone flux. So even if you run out of fuel, uh, if you're running stuff, it'll still last for a little bit. You see right here. All right. We'll switch it to daytime real quick. And then we re then we can go hook up our. Excuse me. Now we can start conserving coal. Because we have the nuclear reactor powering everything. Our more <laughs> That's so creepy. Well, I got it. Thanks, man. Thanks, man. What? What's so creepy? Did you just see box run around? Yeah, I see your box run around. So we can take this. Oh, by the way, any of these, if you just push shift right click, it'll just automatically drop them. Uh, pretty much anything. So this right here is the start of like building a, a pretty functional. Ooh, I'm missing one. Oh, it's attached to the to the pump. All right, and then we can come back here, place our pulverizer. So I don't know if you. Oh no, it kept the. Yeah, if you don't actually mine it, if you just shift right click, it will save the. Uh, like the configuration you have, and if you mine it, it'll actually won't save the it'll it saves the energy too, which is a nice little plus. But if you just straight up mine it, then it um, then you lose all the all the power and it resets it as if you were just put it down for the first time. take the coal out of this so it'll stop well I don't need that flower let's pull Ooh. this back you're gonna like this gal what did I find no you didn't or, find no. anything it's not just like no. what I'm doing. no okay you can call me Gabe remember Gabe 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 ah. Gaybuskus. Gaybuskus. Yes. I'm not the actual Gaybuskus. I wish I was. You're just gay buskus. Gay buskus. Augustus Gloop. Augustus Gloop. Augustus Gloop. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen that forever. But let's see. We have the same Is setup we have going over. It's the. It's Willy Wonka, dude. Willy. Willy Wonka. Willy. Yeah. Willy Wonka. Willy, the, Willy Wonka. Big Willy Wonka. <laughs> really <want> to. <laughs> anyway, but as you can see, we now that we have the nuclear reactor, we are back to processing our ores. Uh, the rate hasn't changed, but the rate also depends on how much power you got going through it, which is the conduit you'll be using as well. And since we have the basic conduit, it's going to take a while. Now I know there's like a, a middleman one. Like, hold on, I'll show you real quick. So let's see. Did I spell that right? Oh, flux duct. They changed the name of it. It used to be called conduit. So you have your basic one, which is lead. Oh, God damn it. It's just lead stone, which is what I made earlier. Uh, now you can make the hardened one, which is like invard. It gives you this weird conversion. But it's really better just to go straight to the the redstone one because as you, as you find yourself moving along pretty quick, you get. It's just better to just put your resources towards this. Plus, you it's you get like. 800 verse, you know, 8,000. It's just better to just go straight to that one, which I will make. I'll show you to make here as we get closer to building those. But for now, I'm probably just going to devote most of my resources to building some more rods for the reactor, so you get more power output. <clears throat> Since we have that, we can start processing some of these ores, and it's actually better now because you can make. Uh, 
can make some more. I'll put these up here for now. I'm gonna build another pulverizer and furnace so we get even more power output. All right, Gal, this is gonna be the pausing point for me because one of my videos or something is corrupt. All right. So I got I can't record anymore until I fix that. And I All want, right. I well, let's uh, why I'm recording. Let's do an outro. Well, I can't. So it's All up right, to you. Well. All right, so I guess this is going to be our stopping point. Um, I'm just going to finish mining out this area because there's a ton of iron down here. And zombies. Um, so, completed two objectives in one video, which will be really nice. Got a nuclear reactor and some ore production. So, as for now, we will see you next time with our next objective, which we need, still need to figure out. All right, goodbye. Thanks, and have a good one. Bye. Bye-bye.